makers, welcome back to Simple Innovation. Today I'm gonna show you a simple Internet of Things experiment connecting ESP32 to my own Node.js backend server, then store the data into PostgreSQL database. So for the hardware, I'm using ESP32, a potentiometer, a DHT11, humidity and temperature sensor, also an LED as the indicator while my ESP32 is sending the data and then it will post the data to my own Node.js backend server which has public URL I'm using Ngrok to create the public URL for my backend server then it will store the data into PostgreSQL database hosted on 11SQL.com let's get started so I've activated my backend server then connected it to PostgreSQL database on 11SQL then using Ngrok I created public URL for my backend server. Here is the API endpoint URL. And then on 11 12, I've created an instance and also a database, also a table called Lintas. Let's see the data inside this table. Execute, select asterisk from public Lintas. No rows return. There is no data here. Okay. Let's power up my ESP32 here. I'm using 5 volt using micro USB and then wait it will post the data every 10 seconds okay the LED is on it means my ESP32 is sending the data on 11 square let's execute the query select asterisk from my table there is the data the first data here suhu temperature 23 lembab humidity 64 and analog for the potentiometer value 0 nice it works let's wait again execute two data here let's try to maximize the potentiometer I will set it to maximum value here okay and let's wait still 0 LED is on, let's execute, select asterisk from public lintans, look at that, 4095, it's maximum value of my potentiometer, great, it works, let's try to set the potentiometer here maybe, and wait again, LED is on, execute 2269 Okay, it works So that's it, a simple Internet of Things experiment Connecting my ESP32 to my own Node.js backend server Which has public URL using Grok Then store the data into PostgreSQL database hosted on 11 For full tutorial, you can check on my GitHub page Thanks for watching, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and see you on the next Simple Project by Simple Innovation. Bye!